Chippers, another edition of Chippers Workshop. Bear with me, once again we're going to do one more project, making a box out of paper, but this time we're going to make it with uh, little tabs to glue it together. So what you're going to need for this project is you're going to need your ruler, your glue stick, your scissors, and your pencil. What I'm going to use for this, so it makes it easier to see on the camera, is I'm actually going to use a tape measure to do the measuring so you'll be able to see the exact measurements. Okay, for this project, what we need to do is we need one three inch strip. Okay, so this is the long way. This is an eight and a half by eleven sheet of paper. We want to go on the short edge three inches in. So I'm going to take my tape measure and I'm going to make my marks at three inches. There's your three inch mark. So I'm going to make a mark there. And I'm going to do the same up here. Okay, now take my ruler, my straight edge, and we're going to put that on our two marks. We're going to draw across. That gives us our three inch square. But now this square has to be eight and a half. And remember, this is 11 inches. So now we're going to measure up eight and a half. So put the tape measure on here again. And this is where you're going to go. There's your eight. And the big hash mark in between is your eight and a half right here. I'm going to make a mark. And again, I'm going to draw that across. Now we've got to cut this out. We don't want this piece, so we put an X on it because that's telling us we're going to discard that piece. Take our scissors. that out. Now we're going to cut out the discarded piece. You'll do the same thing if you're doing a cut like this in wood. You put an X in the area that you don't need. So I cut that out, put that aside. Now what we got to do is we're going to make the tab. Okay, so we're going to make a tab on, on the long end and one on either side. And this is what we're going to cut and that's going to help us glue everything together. So what we're going to do first is we're going to do the long end. Now this is going to be a half an inch. So I'm starting at the one inch mark just to show you and there's your half. So I make a mark and I make another mark. Take my straight edge, line that up on the two marks and we draw our line across. Okay, this is gonna end up being the bottom. So now we gotta do both sides. So how we're gonna do that is we gotta come in a half an inch again. So there's your half. And then we do the same on this side. Come in a half. Take our straight edge. We're going to draw a line and draw a line for a straight. Okay, these are going to be our tabs. So what we got to do now is we want to fold these just like we did in the last uh, box project. But what we got to do first is we got to cut these corners out so the tab will bend. So we'll take that at a diagonal angle like that up to the line, trim it. And then I'm going to do the same thing on this side. And trim it. Now I take my line. And we're going to get that lined up. And then we're going to crease it. All the way down. Okay, you see how that's creased and how we have this right there, the tab there and there. We're going to cut that out. 
going to take the scissors and we're going to cut along that line and cut that piece out. Cut this piece out. Okay, since we're there, we're going to go ahead and cut the other side out before we fold it. So we cut it there and there. Now we've got our pieces cut out. Get that put aside. So now we've got to bend this next. So we're going to take that and we're going to bend that along the line. Flip it around. And we're going to do the same thing there. And that's going to be the edges of our box. So now what we got to do is our box, we want it to be two and a half inches wide on all sides. So now we take our straight edge again and we put that on our fold. See where that fold is? We're going to go two and a half inches, two and a half inches, make a mark. And we draw our line down and draw our line down. So that's where our next fold is going to be. But again, we got where the tab is, we got to trim those. So what we're going to do is we're going to cut that. And we're going to cut that. Okay, so we've got that piece ready to go. That's all folded over. Now for the last side, we're going to need one more piece, three inches by three inches. So come out to three inches, three inches, we're going to come up three inches and three inches right there. Now we're going to draw our line across. And down the other side. Okay, now we're going to cut this piece out. Basically doing exactly the same thing as we did with the bigger piece. And for this piece, we've got to do the same thing. So we're going to need a tab on two sides. And that tab is how many? It's a half an inch. So we're going to come there. Go half an inch, draw that, take the other side, come in a half an inch, make a mark, we're going to draw that line. Again on this piece, got to trim this off. So I'm going to take that and trim that down and then we're going to fold this up to the line. So we get to the line, crease it, pop that out, do the same thing the opposite direction for the other side. So we're going to find the fold, crease that, and again we have these tabs so we're going to cut those tabs out. Okay, now we've got those out of the way, so this is going to be our one side, and this is going to be our three-sided piece. So what i got to do first is I'm going to bend this at the crease for each one of these to make the two and a half inch side. So I'm going to take that, fold that over, crease that, take this one, fold that over on the line, crease that. Okay, so now we've got our three sides. Now we take our fourth side, and now we're going to glue it together. So what we're going to do here is we're only going to do the sides first, not the bottom. So we're going to put glue on that one, and this is going to be the inside flap. So then on this three-sided piece, we do it on the inside there, and the outside there, or the inside there also. 
put that aside. So now we have our box. So we got the glue on the inside. So I'm going to take this piece, line it up, clamp that down. And we're going to take the other side. And we're going to bend that around. Bend that side over, like that there, bend that down, bend that down, and then we have our box. The last thing we got to do is we got to make a bottom for it. The bottom's going to be two and a half by two and a half and set inside. So we're just going to do one two and a half by two and a half piece, two and a half. Two and a half, two and a half. So we cut that piece off, we mark it, and then we're going to cut that piece off. So we're going to cut that out. And before we put glue on it, we're going to make sure that it fits. that out of the way. So there's our piece. Set that in the box. It fits, so I'm going to pop that out. Take my glue stick and I'm going to put glue all the way around all four edges. Glue side down. Take that, put that in, glue that down. And there's your box. Okay, just like the last one that we did, the only pieces were made when we watched that video. This is how you make a box. This also shows us the same thing, how to make it out of wood by having these different bins and uh, tabs that are on there. Thank you, and we'll see you in the shop.